All right, so turn three, uh, pre-planning, pre-mission, pre up, whatever. Uh, yeah, so I just finished uh, mission two and uh, sent up the video for the TAC view, and I figured why it's fresh in my brain of everything that happened. Why don't we, why don't I just record the plan? And hopefully sometime next week I'll be able to, to fly the mission. So we kind of kicked ass. I didn't. But the rest of my guys kind of kicked ass uh, last the last mission, last turn. Uh, the one thing I did do was, as planned, is draw in all of their enemy cap into our Patriot site. So we're probably going to, I mean, that, that worked really well. So we'll spend the first 20, 30 minutes trying to knock out enemy cap uh, as best as possible. I'm not sure. I did see on the TAC view there was some other SAM sites located on the base area. But I think we're ready to start pushing this line forward. The, the one thing we got to watch out for, again, is this S300. Oh, we need to take that guy out. Uh, he, without him gone, we're, Aldafra is completely in that circle. And then the next base we're going to go after is Alain. And we're going to need that gone anyway to even get close to it. And then we got this guy, this guy, this guy as well. And then probably an SA-11 on Al 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 Ain. I don't know how to say it. Uh, I'm not sure what these are. ZU-23s. ZU-23s. Okay, anti-air guns, AAA. These guys. Okay, so they got a bunch of those too. So Al Ain might be uh, a little harder to to take over, um, but we got our work cut out for us before we even get there. So what I was thinking is attacking this with some J sows. They got a pretty long range. Uh, we know the coordinates now uh, because. We were attacked by it, and, you know, the two F F-15 pilots went down on it. Uh, the A-10s were close to it, getting attacked to it. I was got, getting attacked to it. Uh, JTAC's kind of in the area, so we're going to have the coordinates of that S-300. Um, so we're, I'm thinking throwing some JSOWs at it uh, after we clean up some enemy cap. So kind of the same thing we did in the last mission. Hopefully the recording will actually work this time. Uh, well, I, where I go up first, draw an enemy cap, have the Patriots blow them up and then kind of come in and blow up the S 300. So when I did do that in the, the last mission, I didn't even fire a single AMRAM. So I think we're just going to be the bait. I just don't want to be too heavy so I can get out of Dodge if I need to. So we might still do the land rearm and refuel and then head back up and then attack. So that's what I was thinking. Uh, oh, and then we can look at the statistics of how things are going uh, much better, where we kind of increased our forces because we just got the, the order in, and they took a steep decline on that mission. That was, that was great. Uh, for armor, uh, same kind of thing. We're kind of slowly increasing our frontline forces while they're severely decreasing. So things are looking up and up at this point in time. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, spend our 179 million. I really need to get Aldafra to win this uh, because you know each one of these that I didn't blow up is 87 dollars, 87 million per turn. Um, so if I can capture Aldafra, if not this turn, the next turn, we'll start pulling in a lot more money to be able to throw stuff at at all these SAM sites that are out there, uh, which would be good. So, but let's spend a few few dollars that we have now. So we did lose some F-15s, so we'll replenish those. Uh, there's two currently. We'll order another two. Maybe another three. Uh, we got four Hornets, four F-15, F-16, so that's probably good. Uh, three A-10s. We're going to get two more of those because I'm going to send... They, that kind of cleaned up. Uh, that front line and that SAM site for us. Um, for 
ground forces uh we did get our paladin in at 25 mil so i'm curious to see how that is going to play out uh the mlrs was that one that shot a bunch of rockets up and took out stuff on the front line so i really want another one of those but 65 mil is all we have left that would be it is getting one of those and we'd be done so i don't i think we got two that should probably be good we'll make uh the abrams and even six uh, provided we don't lose any uh bradley's are pretty good we'll make that a six strikers even six 16 mil thinking another bradley and then two humvees and that'll do it for money uh and then we're we're gonna put it on aggressive so i don't, I don't know about breakthrough i'm not sure what any of these do but let's move aggressively this turn. So then we'll file save as and lock in our money spent. Uh, missions, liberation, turn three pre-op, save. Ooh. All right. So now we'll get our enemy cap. Or, or not enemy cap, our, our cap. <laughs> so add flight, bar cap. Uh, we'll try these F-15s again. Hopefully they're not redum redumbness. Uh, we'll send two of them up. A sap and do 20 minutes after mission start. And then we'll add in the F-16s. And we have four of them. We'll send two up there as well. Actually, you know what? No. We'll put the F-16s down here like we did last time. That worked out really well. F-16, we'll send two of them up ASAP. And 20 minutes after start. So those guys will go up and the F-15s will go up 20 minutes afterwards. Uh, then we'll get the A-10s. What I'm thinking, we're going to have the A... How many do we have? Three of them. We're going to put one on the front line for Kaz. And we're going to do that 30 minutes after start. I really want to make sure there's no enemy cap in the area. So the A-10 is going to support the front line. The other A-10 is going to new package attack. Uh, these, these BMPs are like armored personnel carriers or something, I think. And same with the BTRs. There's four of those. And two of those. Airfield attack. I think that actually attacks the runway. We don't want to do that because we're going to want to take it over. So let's uh let's have them attack these. So the other other two A tens, we'll throw there. ASAP and they'll come out. Thirty minutes after start, so an hour and four minutes after the mission's in. Uh, I want them to attack Buffalo as well. So let's uh, let's edit their waypoints. Uh, can we insert a waypoint? No, I don't think we can. So strike, strike. We'll add a waypoint for them to 
Ah, what was it called? Buffalo. Buffalo. Add. So that's their job. And then we'll add a RTB waypoint. I'll just go straight back. So let's see what that looks like. Is it come down here? Why would they come down here? Just fly straight over here. Why come down here? I don't understand that. So waypoint information. So we're going to get rid of the hold waypoint for them. Edit. ASAP. What? What is going on? Is it because I deleted those waypoints? <clears throat> Add a waypoint. Leo Air Base. Well, that sucks. I don't understand. What the? Okay, so delete, select a package, add another flight in. I guess we're only going to have them do one at a time. So we'll have one A-10 do one thing and one A-10 do the other. So... We'll have one A ten create ASAP. One uh thirty minutes in there. And then I don't like the hold. I really hate that. If I delete this, is it gonna screw it up? Bear with my learning. Uh, one hour and four minutes he'll be in on target we should be hopefully safe by then um, and maybe we can help take some stuff out too so then we'll add another package uh, buffalo needs to be done as well add flight a10 create asap and one hour oops and yeah, we're just going to hit ASAP again. And you take off in 30 minutes. Save. Close. And get rid of hits hold as well. Okay, so now there's just me. So all we're gonna do is attack that thing. New package, add flight. We're gonna do a seed. Wait, I keep forgetting I have these guys. I forgot I bought Harriers like on turn zero. Uh, okay, we're gonna we're gonna send me. And size one, client one, create ASAP. Save. Okay. So I'm going straight in, seed it. And if I think this might be a little overcommitted here. But I'm thinking we have some other F-18s. We might do, I wish I could do a tar cap on this. Because um, they're just going to fly in. 
wonder if I, I'm going to send another one to attack that as well. Add flight, dead mission. One F-18 ASAP. Uh, and let's do 10 minutes after. Save. So if I don't get anything, maybe he will. All right, next up is my payload. So sidewinders as usual. Nine X's, nine X's, and centerline tank, because we're going to need the gas. All right, so for pylon four is AIM-120s. Do we take them? Yes, we do. These are the cheek stations. So we got two, three, seven, and eight that we can do some stuff with. And I'm thinking JSAO, which is the AGM-154. So AGM... AGM 154C. Wait, what is this? Oh, we can do two. Oh, two A's or two C's. One, two. This might be too heavy. Uh, where'd he go? I think we're going to do it. I don't know. Maybe uh, instead of that, we'll do some GBU 10s. Hmm. I'm looking at my list of different weapons. Those V3s worked really good last time. But those are GPS. I don't want GPS. I want something I can view and pick out. So we're going to do some GBU 10s here. Or can we get smaller ones? GBU 12s. Can we do two GBU 12s? Yes. Two GBU 12s. So hopefully we're not over our max weight. GBU 12s. And then another two AGM 154s, which is the JSAO. Okay, uh, I think that's what we're going to go with. Um, this is a really, really, really heavy loadout. So we're going to be like a, like a stone in the sky. So hopefully it doesn't backfire and kill us. All right, done. Done. Is there anything else I want to do? Yeah, I do. I want to say new package, add flight, use these eight uh, CAS package for the Harriers. Let's see what they're capable of. ASAP. And when did we have our other CAS? 46 minutes in. So they'll arrive. They'll arrive at the same time as the single A-10. So it's an A-10 and two Harriers. Um, actually, you know what? I probably can just add that to this. So it's a little less complicated. Add flight. Create. Yeah, okay. Save. Okay, so that... That's a lot going on. Uh, we're kind of putting all of our resources out there. I really want to capture this base. Uh, this might be a little far for the line to move on aggressive, but if nothing else, we'll be able to take it the, the, for turn four. So let's go ahead and lock in. I'm going to do save as just in case something happens with the video. Again, I can refly the mission. Turn three pre-op, save, locked in.
Okay. Uh, so that's looking like uh, what we got. Uh, let's see how it goes next week, probably.